dog riders welcome to another Thursday video and I want to introduce you to my kitty this kitty's name is serendipity and that is the fly that we are going to cover today the serendipity it is an amazing fly such an incredible fly I named my kitty after it so let's get to the vice and tie this week Thursday's fly the serendipity okay we're going to start with yeah, the normal 70 denier black thread. And like I always say, I like to use the finest thread as possible, unless I'm spinning deer hair. Now, in like Tuesday's video, we're going to use a piece of that yarn. And if you didn't see Tuesday's video, shame on you, but we'll, you just use olive dubbing and just dub this on instead of using this yarn. Now we're gonna run the thread back up to where it's right in the top of the point of the hook. Now we're going to tie in deer hair, <clears throat> fine point or tips of the deer hair first. That's what you're going to tie in. Usually you tuck and tie in the bulk, but this time you're going to tie in the tips. And that's what you're going to tie in so it doesn't create much bulk. You're going to tie that facing back. So the butt ends would be facing back, the tips towards the eye of the hook. Now you're going to grab the tips that are towards the eye and cut them off. And you want to cut them off as close to the thread without cutting your thread as possible. Because you're going to cover them all up with thread wraps. You're going to throw on a whip finish or two. You're going to pull the deer hair towards the front of the hook and then trim it off just to a little stub. Just a real little stub of hair sticking out. Like I said, that's a really deadly fly. Tied it in many colors. Um, check out these other videos. There's one just for you what to watch next. And over here is a playlist of other tying videos. Make sure you check them out. Um, to get your box filled. Man, it's almost fishing season. Get your box filled. Keep your lines wet.